Pakistan is a favourite to take this game. But the to be a big mistake to underestimate the Korean national team. Choking goes high for the head kick. The Korean does a counter reverse. Neither of them scoring. A very fast headshot there by the Korean. Well covered by Shokin. He's got a match on his hands here. The world champion. Cautious exchange. The Uzbek athlete fainting with his left arm. Trying to provoke a reaction. The Koreans having none of it. The Uzbek tries a punch there. In a combination of kicks and movements. Players paying off the front leg, not quite the checking game that we saw in the previous matches. Now bring the kicks inwards. Very tactical game where the heavyweights are looking for the points. Quite subdued affair there afterwards. No points. Silver medalist in Asia Championship in 2015. She gets gold medal in Qatar Open. Silver medal in Australia Open. Shokin choosing not to sit down. He's Staying focused on his feet. He's ready to do. He's quite relaxed and composed. Warning there in Kyongo. Warning against the Korean. Still a cautious affair. Choking holding the center ground, looking for a weakening. Goes up for counter hook kick there as Korean went high as well. Joe takes the first points with a headshot. <laughs> Warning there. Second one gives put Shokin on the board. The 22nd ranked athlete at this um, Grand Prix. The back kick there. Uh, now that scored, that'd be interesting. 
It's registered into the body. It was obviously the impact predominantly was on the arm, but it was so strong a kick that it's registered to the body. So there must have been sufficient impact for the accuracy to be on the body pad, but it's also powerful, really strong kick to register as well. So the two Kyongos against Joe, combined with the back kick by Shokin, gives him a four point to three lead. Still not a great deal of activity, the Korean trying to finish strong. Shokin Dmitri, Uzbekistan. His desert for today are Silver medal in Puyara Open 2014. Asian Championship 2014. He was gold medalist. Australia Open 2014. Silver medal. Paris Open. So the Korean ranks, like medal. I said, just 22nd in, in the world. He's in the number one seed. He was Golden, gold Probably a much stronger Turkish fight than Open. we expected. That back kick there, we get through clearly. The, glanced off, the Koreans there glanced off of him. So one point difference. Not a great deal in this style of competition now. By no means of the imagination, a comfortable lead for Shokin. The world champion goes up for the headshot. Just catches the shoulder on the way up. Tries it again to the open side. More mobile now, looking around, bouncing about, trying to create some openings. Goes off the front leg, choking kicks simultaneously. Neither score. You can see there the Korean tried in for a crescent kick over to the head, but choking extended his arm, stops it on the way up. Korea cut underneath to the body. Activity is increasing now. Sort of side push kick there, cross check by Uzbekistan. A little bit more mobility from the Korean. Nice combination step up. Kicked off his front leg to tie the score. Korean definitely looks the faster of the two, but again, choking through a powerful back kick counter. I don't think many people would have expected this to be so close. But like we said, the opening is always dangerous to underestimate the Korean athletes. And Dimitri goes high there, went high, was just short. Come to the last 10 seconds now, could go to golden point. Let's have an explosion of action, which we are seeing. And Shokin takes a point in that, that exchange. Shokin took the point in that exchange. The Koreans got a Kyongo now as well, but that could be the difference. Oh, tremendously frustrating for the Korean athlete. Shokin held his nerve. Dimitri Shokin, by the skin of his teeth, takes it probably in the last exchange, showing why he's the world champion. A quiet, confident,